Saddle up for a wild ride through history as we unveil the rarest photos 10 still standing saloons of the Old West. These captivating images transport you to a time of cowboys, outlaws, and boundless adventure. Get ready to journey through the untamed frontier in a visual treasure hunt that'll leave you yearning for the past. Grab your hat, partner, it's time to rediscover the Old West. White Elephant Saloon in Fort Worth, Texas. A bar brawl for the ages, the famous gunfight between White Elephant owner Luke Short and Fort Worth Sheriff Longhair Jim Courtright took place at this timeless tap house. Opened in the 1890s in Hell's Half Acre, the bar eventually moved to the historic Fort Worth stockyards. While the White Elephant is now best known for its Texas red chili and live music, its Wild West past lives on, in fact, the long-lost lawman Courtright is rumored to haunt the saloon to this day. Occidental Saloon and Hotel in Buffalo, Wyoming Despite elegant additions made way back in 1908, which included a stained-glass accented back bar and an embossed tin ceiling, you can't take the Wild West out of this old-time barroom, a Buffalo favorite since 1880. Look up, and you'll still spy bullet holes in the ceiling from past shootouts involving former patrons, who included Buffalo Bill Cody and Calamity Jane. Big Nose Kate Saloon in Tombstone, Arizona Built in 1880 as the Grand Hotel, this historic establishment frequented by the likes of outlaw Doc Holliday and the Clan Tun Gang burned down just two years later. It was reconstructed and operated as Big Nose Kate's Saloon. Named after Mary Catherine Horney Cummings, the common-law wife of outlaw Holiday, the saloon, which contains the original long bar from the short-lived Grand Hotel, serves southwestern cuisine and draft beers, and hosts Wild West reenactments. The Salty Dog Saloon in Homer, Alaska Since its construction in 1897, the Salty Dog has served variously as a post office, schoolhouse, and grocery store. It wasn't until 1957 that the structure became, and has remained, a saloon. Novel touches include a lighthouse that was built to cover a water tower, and the thousands of dollar bills on its walls, tacked there by loyal patrons over the years. Crystal Palace Saloon in Tombstone, Arizona Local notables like U.S. Deputy Marshal Virgil Up and gunshot-wound expert Dr. George Goodfellow swung through the doors of this cheery red brick drinking hole in Tombstone that served its first drink in 1879 as the Golden Eagle Brewery. Another character who haunted this establishment was gunfighter Buckskin Frank Leslie, known for his trademark buckskin jacket and his deadly blows, who did a short stint as a night watchman. Pioneer Saloon in Good Springs, Nevada Though featured as a backdrop in films like Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas and The Mexican, Pioneer Saloon enjoys a vibrant life in the real world as a popular stop for barbecue or a spirited game of horseshoes. After the crash of the airplane carrying his wife, Carol Lombard, and 21 others in 1942, it is said that Clark Gable drank his sorrows away in this historic saloon, where he waited for news of her fate. Bucket of Blood in Virginia City, Nevada Despite its sinister-sounding name and the fact that it started in the aftermath of a tragedy, the bar opened in the wake of the Great Fire of 1875, which claimed more than 1,000 local establishments. Bucket of Blood has a reputation as a good-time hangout. Patrons know and love the saloon for its bar crawls, annual chili cook-off, and live music from the house band, David John and the Comstock Cowboys. If you like this video make sure to subscribe to the channel and press the bell notification. See you in the next video.